too. Let me die in spring, under the blossoming trees. Mm -hmm. And who might you be? Ah, uh, well, if you insist. My name is Yukichi Fukuzawa. I am a samurai from Nakatsu. I am working for the shogunate while I complete my studies. And this here is Ernest Sato. He's a British interpreter. Pleased to meet you. Fukuzawa-san was just teaching me more of his marvelous language. Oh, I fear I have very little left to teach you. It is I whose language skills are lacking. I must learn English. Tell me, what brings you here? Of course, but keep it brief. The American Consul General, Harris? Well... Hold on one minute. What do you want with him? His life was threatened just the other day, you know. I'm certainly not going to lead a perfect stranger directly to his door. Why, just look at you. You might very well be an assassin. I won't pretend to understand your motivations. Fukuzawa-san, you are keen to meet with the Consul, are you not? Perhaps this individual could come with. Even if they are an assassin, they couldn't do much if you were there. You are a master martial swordsman, after all. Very well. I'm not convinced, but I will do as you wish. The Consul is in a temple near the Kanagawa post. Fukuzawa-san will show you precisely where. Hold on! Do you not intend to accompany us? Attacks on foreigners in that particular area are on the rise. I will remain here. You should have no trouble, however. Hmm. Well, I suppose you're right. I'll go ahead and see how things are looking. Meet me at the Kanagawa post. You have business with me? Very well then. I read about it in a wonderfully illustrated travelogue of a man who spent some time here. He described the various customs of this land in such vivid detail. It was a world so strikingly different from the one I knew. Nothing like the grim and stony cities of England. I couldn't put the book down, and before I realized it, I had turned the last page, enthralled to this faraway land. If you say so. I take my leave.
Over here. We must be careful. This place is more dangerous than I thought. I was informed that the console was in Hongakuji Temple, but as far as I can tell, it is now in the hands of expulsionist forces. I found no trace of Harris himself. Where could he be? When the Americans first arrived, they transformed the temple into their first consulate. And so began the whispers that the cholera epidemic could be traced back to this town. Needless to say, these are entirely groundless rumors. Agreed. It would be a tragedy if anything were to happen to him. Let's get moving. Over here. The temple of Hongakuji was built approximately 600 years ago. However, the Americans have essentially repurposed it ever since we opened our doors to them. Whether it's outbreaks of cholera or more attacks by those who wish to drive out the foreigners. Truly, this has been far from a happy place of late. <sighs> that corpse appears to have been a local resident. Can the anti-foreign forces really be targeting their own countrymen? It is one thing to hate the West, but this is wanton violence. Why are those wretches so utterly repulsed by the unfamiliar? I'm afraid I must conclude that reason and understanding are far more present in Western society than in our own homeland. Now if the Consuls truly managed to flee the temple, he's probably still somewhere in this vicinity, don't you think? Doubtless, he is being pursued by expulsionist samurai, though killing him would serve little purpose at this stage. Either way, we must find where the Consul is hiding. Very good. Now, I have no doubt that his pursuers will be in an agitated state. Let's have a good nose around and see if we can't find any clues as to Consul Harris's location. to business. here, but no sign of Consul Harris.
ぜひはふざけるなめ
looking for something? the concert. Yeah. 
But I will not allow you to lay a finger on him. Wait a second. You're Jules Brunet, the French officer. It's me, Yukichi Fukuzawa. Ah. I remember. We met at the Grand Villa. But what are you doing here? Mr. Sato asked me to come here to speak to the consul. Is he to be found here? Fear not. Consul, they are friends. I thank you, good sir. <laughs> Where would I be without the French? What in the world? How are you still alive? I've had just about enough of your harassment. Why would I believe that? Look. I don't know who hired you, but I guarantee I can pay double. Oh, you mean that other bodyguard that couldn't kill you? I suppose I did see the two of you having a chat. How about this? You take care of some scoundrels for me. And I'll tell you what I know about them. We were attacked by a band of thugs and forced to flee the temple. Until they are dealt with, we are stuck here. There is no sense in fighting every last one of them. I propose that I join you and Fukuzawa and that we hunt down their leader. With him out of the picture, his underlings will melt away. They are little more than a rabble. And if nothing happens to me, I'll tell you everything I know about the samurai from the consulate. So, have we a deal? Great. Now, to avoid attracting attention, let's leave one at a time. We'll regroup on the hill overlooking the temple. like you know your way around a fight. How about putting your skills to the test? It's simple. All you have to do is take down my friend over there. They say Japanese warriors can hold their own against guns, and I want to see it for myself. Come on, show me what you can do. Just for that. Here's something by way of thanks for the fine display.
just saw a most unsettling looking man entering the main hall. I am certain he is their leader. Well, are you all set to enter the temple? Good. Then we shall proceed under cover of darkness. They may be a disorderly lot. But there is strength in numbers. Time. Looking for something? What are you doing here? Get in my way, and I'll cut you down. After me! What's this? But you're reduced to being a foreigner's lapdog. Working with the outsiders. Yeah. 
Irrelevant. The issue isn't about if they're good or bad. Haven't you heard? The first American consulate was in this village, along with the outbreak of cholera. We should never have had dealings with foreigners. It endangers us all. This is a belief I am willing to fight for. The mob has obeyed their leader's order and dispersed. Our plan worked. Very well then. About my curious bodyguard. They were captured in Yokohama by Commodore Perry some years ago. They were taken back to the United States and held in custody. We were deeply relieved when we realized they wanted to cooperate. How the hell should I know? I just hired them to protect me. However, I did hear a great deal about Japan on our voyage over. Working for me was their idea. I'm not such an imbecile to try to strong arm them. And thanks to that, we were able to conclude the Commerce Treaty. But then they up and vanished. Well, that sums up what I know. Any questions? Ah, that mechanical arm was made in the United States. It can fire shells and steel wire. Quite the device, I must say. Well, it was the very day after we signed the treaty. Didn't even bother to collect their pay. Come to think of it, I heard the British might have also requested their services. Now, that will be all for the moment. Should you need to know any more, save it for another day. Fukuzawa. I am going to escort the Consul General to a safe location. Once things settle down, we'll make contact via the Grand Villa. I think we made a good connection there. I look forward to learning more about the United States. I plan to continue my education there one day. Showing Yoshida could not realize his dream. But I fully intend to make it happen. Shoin Yoshida is wanted for conspiracy against the Shogun. But by now I imagine he has already been apprehended. Now I shall take my leave. Until next time. So, how do you plead? Have I not made myself clear? The Shogunate serves a purpose no longer. That is why I urge our people to rise decisively as one. It is they who must build this nation anew. What can the people possibly do? They must stand behind the Shogunate. Or we all fall to the foreigners. You wish to keep our country safe? Then the people must fall in line. So this is the nation you want? A land of purges and repression? 
Your insolence and insubordination are unforgivable. You must be punished by execution. Take him away! <coughs> <coughs> Huh? 